decision based on the fact that a business was done worth 4 billion that no, wasn't he, done. He, he never he's out of order. He is not out the of order. The intention even he to commit a crime order. is not honorable, a crime in itself. Honorable Babu. Chairman, uh, Honorable no, Rashid no, is out of order. No, honorable Babu. He's already perceiving Hon Honorable Hon Murad as being guilty, yet he's not. Hon there was no Hon supply Hon that was Hon made. Hon Hon honorable Babu. Kenyans should know that. Honorable Babu, we know. No, Rashid. Rashid. Rashid, just hold on. Honorable Owino, maybe one day, maybe one day, you will be uh, uh, honored enough to sit where I am sitting. And I want to assure you, the day that you are honored to sit where I am sitting, the only thing that will be able to guide you and guide your members is following the standing orders. And I need to read out to you the standing orders 107 that a member commits an act of disorderly conduct if the member, and I want to take it to C, unnecessarily interrupts proceedings or consults in a disruptive manner. You are an honorable member. You have made your point. The world has known, I have insisted and I have said it, there are two issues here, intent and whether it was done. Honorable Murade, in the process of listening to others, has been able to give us better information. That information would never have come out properly if the chair who is here was going to behave in the manner that you wish to. Allow, allow your colleagues, learn the art of listening so that you can be able to learn the art of responding. Thank you, on, Chair. On, I've heard you. Thank okay. you very much. Can, can I respond to that question? I, I think, Rashid, Rashid, you have... You, you no, have no I, I need to respond to yeah. something you just said, that yes. the whole thing, 4 billion, was the entire budget of Kemsa. All right? Yeah. He asked you whether you are aware. You said... No, I said I'm not. But uh -huh. there's a letter here, which forms part of the commitment letters and whatever. And what they have said, Kemsa, and you have that letter, the government of Kenya in preparedness to respond to coronavirus threat in the country, has identified your organization on a strategic partnership to supply cancer with the following items. And that's where they give that whole list. So this should ideally suggest that they could probably have been looking for a government to government arrangement. Already you're having issues with the vaccines where people have had one vaccine, you don't know whether you're going to get the other vaccine. Yeah. Israel has vaccinated more than 80,000 of its people. The schools are open, the businesses are opening. They were even purported to have paid double the price. Right now, you have kids at Kemsa, nurses are on strike, health workers are on strike. Those kids, whether delivered by Kemsa, uh, by Kilig or anybody else, are lying out there when people out here are crying for the kids. Honorable Murad. I thought you no, uh, no, as parliament no, no, you should no, be helping no, 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 this country no, 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 deal no. with the pandemic. Honorable Murathe, now let me teach you law. Honorable Murathe, I have I've told you this before. Hon just, Honorable Murathe, I asked you and I requested you that you were going very well. He just simply asked you a question whether you are aware you answered no. But now you decided to take this with a sideshow. Now let me give you what the facts are. Kemsa, by law, by law Kemsa is meant to buy at a competitive rate. Kemsa failed to do that. The document that you're reading was a typical document for every other company that was given an opportunity to be able to be given these commitment letters. And at no given time, at no given time, and I would advise you as well, because you are under oath, you should not start insinuating or trying to indicate that Mr. Manjari probably thought that it was going to be a government-to-government -government thing. Because Mr. Manjari has sat where you are sitting, and he never provided that information. The CS for Health and the PS for Health in their own submissions have never given that kind of a submission. I'm not saying... No, you are, you're please. trying to indicate, Honorable Murade, what I will request you. All right? Not for any other reason, but because this committee has other things to do as well. Okay. So, Rashid, get to your point. But, Chair, we need to respect yeah, uh, no, Rashid. No, no, uh, we need to respect uh, on, Honorable uh, Murade. Uh, no. Let me tell you, respect is earned. Respect is not a title. Which is true. Chairman. And, and I think, Honorable Owino, right now, 
that earning on, on yourself is demeaning. No, no. My interest is simple. No, Chair, let me clarify my interest. I want to clarify my interest. Yes, yes, I have an interest. We need to talk, Chair. Honorable Rashid, continue. Honorable Rashid, continue. Choose the one interest, I want to clarify. Honorable Rashid, continue. Thank you. Honorable Bugrade. You're very economic, uneconomical. I want you to put your microphone. You're uneconomical with the truth. Look at your answers on eighth. You said you're not aware about the budget, but you are clearly said KEMSA commitment letter by KEMSA to killing limited was cancelled, citing budget what? Citing limited budget for the COVID. So you're fully aware. Where is you, the you, economy the truth? Hmm? But you said you are not aware about the budget. You Except must have been aware no, when you gave I am an answer. Saying no, 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 yeah. uh, 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 no, no, chair. Here you have to. No, 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 we have uh, to clarify. Uh, uh, Babu, the letter cancelling that commitment letter cited budgetary constraint, cited budgetary. So I'm aware that. So you are aware. Do, 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 you, do, you, you, you have. No, you, let's go to Rashid. Honorable Murade, no? Honorable Murade, I, this one. I, no, I, I agree that you have to answer it. You said that there was a letter that Kemsa did to Kilig, isn't it? To tell them that the commitment is cancelled due to budget because we have no money. Do you have a copy of that letter with you? Yes. Uh, do you have it? With I you? don't yeah. have it, but I can get it. Okay. Kilig can go, provide it. Go, go ahead, go so, ahead, Rashid. All right. So you have a letter saying that the, you cannot proceed procurement of goods and services worth four billion because of budget. Because they didn't have the money. Because they didn't have the money. Exactly. And yet, they had earlier offered a commitment letter of worth 4 billion shillings based on a budget. They had given to several people. And they had timelines. And there was no price in that thing, by the way. Nowhere had they said supply this at X. Nowhere. Are we clear? Actually, it has 102 companies, and all those letters were standard. Yes. But, was uh, there a price? Uh, uh, in some of them, yes. But was there a price? Yes. But, but, uh, the, 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 the price the, uh, came after you delivered, and now you negotiated, and an LPO was issued. Not before. The commitment was you are saying you can deliver. You have to bring. When you bring, confirm that it conforms. Then we the procurement uh, process begins. In this case, no procurement process began. Period. So I agree, Honorable Murade, that based on your influence, I don't know where first you drive your influence from. Where is your source of power and influence? Somalis. Chairman, that is out of order. My source Honestly, of power is my Somali friends. Yes. No, uh, Honorable Murade, Honorable Murade. No, he's laughing. No, 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 no. But let him also funny. ask, no, let no, him no, ask whatever question. What is he asking? Honorable Babu, what is he asking? He's laughing. No, Honorable Babu, would you like to excuse us? Chairman, oh, no, this no, man is laughing. Babu. No, he listen, must tell us listen to me, listen to me, the two of you, all right? Rashid, I asked you and I gave you an opportunity to ask the questions. So I'm asking. Allow yourself, listen to me, you're a politician. Yeah. Allow yourself not to be derailed. Himself, Harman Murale has cited for lack of budget. So was the entity aware when they were offering four billion shillings commitment letter that there will be a perceived lack of budget for this exercise. Which entity? KEMSA. How would I know? I can't answer on behalf of KEMSA. Okay. Thank you. Finally, Next question. Finally, my finally. There was a there was a comment which was in the social media. Social media. No, 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 we will not. I have made Rashid, this ruling. You are in Tanga Tanga. Oh, Honorable Rashid, no, I have made this ruling before. Yeah. We know you. You are All right. I, I, you want uh, to finish uh, 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 Omar, please ask your questions. <laughs> Omar, please ask your questions. No, Rashid. No, I have made a ruling before and I'm not turning on it. Yeah. I disallowed Honorable Babu yeah. from making remarks in terms of talking and giving reference to media. I will not know. Yeah. 
Rashid, you are root of a friend. We know you, you want to finish Murabi. We know you. Honorable Babu. No, just a moment. Honorable Chair. He has offered a letter and a document presented to you insinuating the involvement of the Deputy President in this case. Which he has done it here and I've already made a ruling on this. I want him to confirm. You see he's protecting Ruto. And he said it. The Deputy President also ate cancer. He said it. It is the public. Can he give us clarity? On what? That if he has certain information regarding but he has already given this this information. What more do you want? What more do you want? He has given this information and I've given the ruling that we are going to write to KCB. Now please switch off your microphone and let's get into into. Listen to me, all of you. We are not going to we are not going to get into levels of politics here. All right. Kumbe is the And and and, and no, listen to me, Mr. Murade. Believe me. All right. <laughs> I was born and raised in politics, I've lived my whole life in politics, no one here will be able to teach me politics. But right now, I represent the interests of Kenyans, politics aside. The issues of the word Tanga Tanga and, and whatever it is, that one will be now be kept aside and we'll get to the bottom of this. The issue here is what Kenyans want. Honorable Omar. Thank you, Chairman. From the onset, I want to uh, tell uh, the witness that he's under oath. And what I'm supposed to ask, he should uh, make sure that uh, he should be guided by Honorable members, uh, I'll allow your colleague to be able to, to speak. Uh, yes. Mukami, Mukami. You will, you will speak. Next time come Ali Mukami, you will speak. Omar, go ahead. Ho Honorable Omar, go ahead. Chairman, I think this is not a marketplace and you must be able Honorable to Omar, go ahead. Out of order. Honorable Babu, at this rate, and, 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 and let it just be known, at this rate, Honorable Babu, you will be forced to excuse us. Correct. Chair, what's Honorable good for the, no, what's Honorable good for the Babu, Ganda is good for the goose. Honorable Babu. So Rashid will follow me. Oh, Honorable Babu, at this rate, you will be forced to excuse us. Honorable Omar. Thank you, Chairman. Uh, number four on the Abedavid. Uh, the witness indicated that he is aware that Kilik Limited had engaged partners who had promised financing for the purchase of PPE kits in connection with Kemsa's commitment letter, but the partners experienced delays in securing the financing. Now that you are aware, my question is, who are these partners? I have given the thing to the chair. Okay, thank you, thank you, that's fine. In the transfers. That's fine, it's good enough. Is this, is this the one that you're talking about, the one for KCB? No, the transfers, where uh, William and uh, Zhu transfer uh, the, the to Bush uh, and his uh, clients, yes. Yes, is this it's the there. one you're referring to? Yes. Okay, go ahead, Omar. Thank you, I just, I just wanted to know. Are you aware, or at what point did you, seek, did you be a signatory to Kilik's account? At what point did it cease? Immediately, the commitment letter was cancelled. When was that? I can't remember the actual date, but once there was no procurement to proceed with, that whole arrangement came to an end. Are you aware that that account is still active? I'm aware, because it was not meant for just that business. So, do you have any documentation? To I am not a signatory in that no, account no. today. In fact, Chair, I have now the current uh, signatories and directors of that account today. Then you'll find I'm not. Please uh, just, just, just table that, yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Here. Uh, can someone just, just uh, give us that? I am not. This is information that equated by and members, and I think current, already. Uh, current status uh, of that account. That account was not opened to do uh, COVID. Sorry, you're not a signatory. Very well. Uh, I, think, I think I know where I'm heading to this. You did indicate that there was no personal benefit. Yes. Whatsoever. Yes. In terms of you guaranteeing between Kilik and uh, the other company. Entech. Entech. Right. You have no benefit whatsoever. No. So my question is, are you that philanthropic to assist any person who wants to do business between one another? Are you that philanthropic to uh, guarantee yeah. or to give assurance, whatever you say, yeah. between two different entities yeah. that you don't accrue any benefit whatsoever? I even stand bail, cash, for friends. And once they get the money back from the courts, I don't go claiming it back. 
Chamorale and that have stood for that's very prominent people here if you want to hear the names. Is, is it in, in relevance to this? Yes, because you're asking no, 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 how no. would you guarantee somebody and you are not expecting any benefit? Correct? If I understand you correctly, facilitating a friend to do his business. Do you have to go and ask for a benefit? Murabe. Uh, yes, Honorable Murabe. Uh, the fact is that uh, nobody is telling you not to be philanthropic as you put it. But we, are, we want to find out the facts. Which I'm going to uh, you know, supply to this committee during report writing. You said under oath that you are not accruing any benefit whatsoever. Hon Honorable Omar, I need to, to advise you for no, purposes. I, I want no, to no, hear no, what no, is no, no, but, but uh, before he continues, if it is anything in any way that implicates on uh, Mr. Murave in any way and you fail to give him an opportunity, I just need to advise you, Omar, then you will be denying him an opportunity to be able to respond. So I just uh, want him to say under oath okay. that he has not, and he has not accrued any benefit whatsoever. And, and that's what I'm saying, in the event that you... By the way, is it considering there was no procurement? Uh, 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 Where is it? Chairman, go ahead. I think you need to guide this witness. Uh, the proper way of addressing this committee. Uh, I asked my question and you are mandated to answer it or to ignore answering it. You don't have to argue with me. Chairman, I, my, I, I rest my case by saying that this witness said that he has not, he, is not, he, he went into this commitment and he became a signal to that account knowing very well that he is not accruing any benefit whatsoever. Yes. They say that in an oath. Yes. yes. I rest my case. Okay. Uh, uh, no, Babu, we've, we've already had you. Here, I think you wanted to... to burning, burning issue. Yeah. Uh, uh, l uh, cool it down with, uh, Chairman, with thank uh, water. Uh, thank you. Uh, <laughs> Chairman, that question has been asked, but I just wanted to remind one thing, uh, and this is for general information. Whether there was no payment, whether there was no invoicing, whether there was no uh, procurement process that has taken place, the fact remains that there is a commitment letter given by KEMSA. And this commitment letter the initial intention was to do business. The initial intention was to do business. Therefore, the issue of saying, what if that process has gone to its finality and goods will have, will have been supplied, the payment will have been made definitely. So, when, when people are saying that there was no scandal, there was nothing, because there was no supply of these kits, we are basing our investigations on the given out of commitment letters to various business entities. I think Thank I've read out the, the standing orders, honorable members, and I think this is important as well for us to be able to. One, I want us to be all on the same page that yes, uh, uh, there was a commitment letter. The commitment letter, the valuation was based on the fact that what it was that they were paying. They did not pay anyone less than 9,000 shillings for each PPE. So at 450,000, you multiply that is what comes to that figure of 4 billion shillings. Secondly, this commitment letter was cancelled. After a few days, it was revived again. We do not know what happened, and, that, and I'm glad that Mr. Gashoka is outside. He will be able to advise us because he was the director at that particular time. Um, uh, to wind up, I need to ask you, because this is very, very vital. Mr. Uh, Murade, you said that, uh, uh, the, according to your affidavit, you said the people who, who approached you was Zhu Jinping and uh, Mr. Gashoka. Yes. Isn't is it? Correct. Okay. Are, are you aware when they approached you? I can't remember. It was in the course of when the guys who they gave the company were not able to do it. And the same Mr. Zhu was uh, known to Entech, Mr. Chen. Then that is where they came and said, look, those guys were unable to do it. These guys have the kids, but they are insisting they need an assurance that if they give us to deliver and we are paid, we will pay them. And for you, the information of this committee, Chairman, I gave my statement to the EACC. Uh, fair enough. I am uh, the one who even gave them the bank accounts. All right? And those things are available. Okay. All right? Uh, uh, the uh, question is, what? Uh, why am I here? Actually, that is what I cannot understand. No, uh, m m Mr. Mr. Murade. Mr. Murade. 
No, 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 Mr. Murave, listen to me, listen to me. Mr. Murave, the issue of why you are here, this committee has sat down and listened to hundreds of witnesses, right? No one is superior or inferior to any other. We will call, listen to me. Yes. You see the way you've told us here, yeah. that there are people here, even these people will be called. Even and Juma was yesterday in the New York. Uh, listen, uh, listen to me, Mr. Murade. You, you, Mr. Murade, you will switch off your microphone as I give you an opportunity. Thank you. Let's behave like leaders that we are. Now, I need to ask you, this is a very vital matter. I asked you, and stop derailing, I asked you a simple question. When was it when these people approached you? And I have a reason as to why. Do you know the date? When did they approach you? It must have been Chairman. around May. Around May. Chairman, yeah. Okay. No, no. Chairman, I, I don't have the specific. Unless you... No. Uh, Robbie, you Chairman, if you check, Ro no? Robbie, Robbie, there's I'm, something I'm, I wanted Robbie. to say, no. Chairman. Robbie, I'm on, Chairman. The floor. I'm on the floor, Robbie. You will switch off your microphone. After I'm done, I've gotten your... No, I wanted to take him out, the Chairman. He's saying. No. I just wanted to answer the question he's saying. He's not aware why he's here. We're, we're through with that. Those are side shows that we will not even... Chair, these are Tanga Tanga people. Yeah, no, whatever they are, Babu. <laughs> honorable, honorable members. Chair, chair you need to take no, a shot no, 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 Chairman, no, I think no, I can answer that no, question. Which chair, 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 chair. Chair. Honorable chair. members, a no, point every... A point of order. Uh, no, there's no, there's no one, there's nothing out of order. We cannot trivialize no, this issue. I, I, I need, I need you to answer this question. Mr. Murade. Mr. Murade. I will not allow at any given time for us to be derailed. I asked a simple question. When did Mr. Zhu Jinping and Mr. Gashoka approach you? I need you to say, check. You said it was in May. I need to check when that account was opened because around that time. Okay. And the reason why I'm asking you that is because by the date of them approaching you, by the date of them approaching you, and this, these are now the issues that members need to get, get facts of. By the time they approached you, Mr. Zhu Jinping had ceased to be a shareholder of this company. So what was the interest of Zhu Jinping in approaching you? It is the company, his company. I told you, no, it, it was not by wait, the time... Wait, 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 chair. Yeah. This company was not incorporated just for the sake of COVID. No. It had a reputation. No, um, they uh, had a, no, let me finish. No, no. Zhu Jinping did not seize what they did. They transferred the company to Bush and Company. Okay. Bush and has then since returned the company back to, to IV. IV. Yes. But now, uh, the reason why I'm asking you this is because these are the issues now we need to put into the report. This is a document that you provided us right now. Mm -hmm. That the current signatories for this is a Mr. Chen Chao. Yes. Uh, Ivy, who is the current director. Mr. Wilbred Gagatei, who right. actually formed this company with Zhu Jinping. Right. Zhu Jinping appears to have disappeared. Would right. you be having the contacts of Zhu Jinping? Zhu is a prominent uh, Chinese uh, person in this country. No, we, we don't know him. That's why we are asking you. Would I'm you sure they were saying you even have his uh, affidavits. No, actually, we don't have his affidavits. The affidavits that My we have are for a Mr. Chen Chao. No, no. Is he part of those uh, mandates? M Mr. Murade, Somebody I like you, you would come and introduce me to somebody, right? I said, I'm known to Zhu. I'm known to William. All right? Whether he was a signatory or a shareholder or whatever, after they transferred to the deputy president's uh, associates, he can say, now this thing has gone south. We have uh, these friends who have uh, the kids who are able to deliver, but they need an assurance that when Kilik, which he was still associated with, is paid, they will be paid. Okay. So uh, uh, my question to you is that since you've told us that this is a person that you've done work with and, and everything else, we would uh, request you to just provide us the details of Mr. No problem. Mr. Jinping. Thank you there very much. There is no problem. All right. Now, uh, the... the uh, 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 other question, um, 
that that is uh, that there is there is uh, in terms of the guarantee you said there was nothing that was done in writing isn't it yeah it's not the contractual meaning of guarantee and i clarified it to Mr. honorable uh, kajong it is like a comfort assurance i assure you um, uh Abdul Samad will pay you yeah. okay now the reason i'm asking that is because chen chao still remains to become a signatory mm. of of this particular account are you aware are you aware of he does what he still may, remains a signatory of this account chen chao after his, this is a document that you provided us yeah but that is before during or after the cancellation even after the cancellation yeah chen chao this is a letter of course we'll now have to get in touch with equity to confirm this email yes yes because this is not dated it is only the time is uh, 1549 there is another one which he tells you sometime in july the date uh, yes and it the, is uh, the same date so this uh, is on different the date of july and there's another one different time there is like 4 minutes apart Well, this could be the time of printing because this was from a phone. It's an email from the bank. Yeah, yeah I understand. But uh, uh, if, if we go into uh, IT savvy issues, this is a screenshot from a phone, and that is why there's bars here and showing that this is 4G. You can check with the bank, and that's why I said I will check with the bank. Please. I just simply asked you a question. Yeah, it is vital. I'm sure you, it, it is in our interest to finalize that we just get get it on with. Right. I just need to ask you: Is Chen Chao continues being a signatory here? Of what? Of Kilik. This I have no business with Kilik at this point. No, but this this so is a document. That letter I give you is to show you that that you are not there. By the there. time I got out, that's what I'm saying. They were left to their devices, Kilik and Entech. Okay, that's what I'm asking you. Yeah, Honorable Murate. Yeah, please. Just, just hear hear me out, I and I need to tell you as well to learn the art of listening once more. How do you tell? All right. So I'm asking you that this is a document that Chen Chao continues being there. Uh, this is and the I document. And I get out because the transaction for which we are, I was we are, in we are is finished. We are all in agreement that you're no longer there. Yes. But Chen Chao remains to be there, isn't it? Yes. Okay. Would you be aware as to why Zhu Jinping is not there? No. Okay. Uh, I, I think we need to have Mr. Gashoka now in. Is there anything else you want to add? Oh, you know, I, I, I need to say something else. Uh, this is very vital. Since the media is here and everyone else is here, we from here, the clerks are going to immediately write to Kenya Commercial Bank. Uh, I want it to be, uh, you know, because I, I'm trying to imagine now what the headlines tomorrow will be. That this is one company where two different bank accounts. One is an associate of the deputy, and the other is uh, an associate of the president. That that is what the headlines will be. <laughs> But I want us to be very, very clear on one thing. I want us to be very clear on one thing. We are going to call the people who are in this. in this company i do not know who is here this is information that mr uh, murade has been able to graciously provide to us and we will ask those people whether they are actually related in any way uh, and i'm hoping that uh, when they come in as well they don't tell us that their involvement was also just to guarantee because they are also influential <laughs> because everyone seems just to be guaranteeing but uh, is there anything else you want to add Yes, Miss, you wanted to add something? Yeah, che, che, I'm sorry I came late, but for the purposes of the public and even the media, you have talked about the delivery of nine million, which is being purported as samples. So, can we understand where the payment was done for those nine million? I think million I've, I've already delivery? indicated it already. As a matter of fact, Kilik has not invoiced for that amount. However, uh, for pub, and this is now very, very vital for legal issues. For legal issues, you see, it can be construed as well that a, 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 a procurement process has already started, and I want it to be known that as far as the audit report is concerned, there were goods that had already been supplied, right? And I want us to be very, very equally clear, Mr. Murade, that the company that uh, you are you are guaranteeing, uh, we need to get to the bottom of this because we don't want a situation whereby three years from today, maybe when Honorable Babu is the one who is chairing this committee, maybe we don't want a situation whereby we are now having a killing trying to sue for something they never supplied, and it's happened before.
and I think that is now on, on this on this committee to ensure that nothing of that nature uh, is going to happen to Kenyans. Uh, uh, yes, uh, Rahab has not said anything, and then we'll have uh, honorable members. What I will request you: we've gone so well, we've already managed to get the information that we want. Let us let us have our closing remarks to be as non-political as possible, honorable members. Yes, Rahab. Uh, thank you, Chair. Now I was going to uh, through the affidavit. And I've listened to Honorable Murade, and uh, from what I'm understanding, he has tackled those questions as per his affidavit. Because uh, initially there were rumors that he is one of the directors, he has confirmed that he is not a director of that company, and the company was not ma uh, paid any money. The board of contention is only that he guaranteed Kirigi of which I know all the banks, they normally do that. Uh, so what I can say, uh, Babu Oino was a bit uh, harsh on us, because as a committee, when we come here, we normally talk as legislators. So what I can say, share, I think from uh, what uh, Murase has uh, presented uh, uh, to us, personally I've understood, and I think now we should now talk to the owners, the register, members of that company of Kiri. Thank you very Thank much. You, uh, well, no, before yourself, Papa, because uh, you've already... Well, Just the Robbie. last word, it's okay. not a harsh one. Robbie, and then we'll have yourself. Thank you, Chair. Uh, it's good also I say something before Mr. Murade leaves this committee. Mr. Murade, I'm also a member of Jubilee, and my advice to you as our Vice Chair use your title well. Uh, uh, that's Robbie, out of Mr. order. Robbie, eh, eh, uh, no, honorable, honorable Babu. Mr. Robi, I, I had already made a ruling on this. And in fact, I had even... I, 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 a, no, 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 that's no, my no, 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 no. Le, 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 listen, if you want to give someone political advice, this is what you can do. This party or any other party has a constitution. In their constitution, they should, should respect the boss. They, they, should, they, they, should, they should get their delegates' conferences. And in those delegates' conferences, they can lecture Mr. Murade okay. on what, what it is. For right now, chair. no. For right now, as we, are here, as we are here, our role is not at all to advise people on how to lead their political lives. All right? Let, let's just okay, not an advice. Yes. Now, I just want to say. Next time, don't get involved to companies which you say maybe... Ah, that's not your duty. No, no, Honorable Babu, I think... Respect your vice chairman. No, Honorable Babu, he, he, uh, I, unless you have also defected. <laughs> Babu, but, what is uh, your interest? Uh, no, I will uh, explain. Uh, uh, I will explain. Uh, uh, Robbie, is there Take something else you want to add that okay. is related to this? Thank you, if sir. he needs your advice, I'm sure you guys can meet on the corridors that's and you can give each other uh, friendly advices. Babu, Thank you, Chair. Number one, I've been asked a very serious question of what my interest is. Number one, Chair, the main aim why we are investigating this KEMSA issue is to bring to book those who stole money. The reason why I'm talking like this, and I've just looked at social media, Twitter, I've seen myself trending that I'm defending Honorable Murade. The reason why I'm doing it, Chairman, is because Honorable Murade was never given a tender worth four billion and they never supplied. Thank so there was no four, four billion money involvement. Yeah. Kenyans should know clearly. We fight those who stole money. All right. Thank uh, you. Uh, 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 I think, Rashid, let's have the, the next witness, all right? Thank you very much, Mr. Yeah, Murabe. but uh, just to conclude, Chair, it's very sad when we allow this kind of innuendo, like when those headlines from the newspapers or COVID billionaires, and then you want to treat some of us as this poster boy of uh, that business. I have never supplied not even a single mask or a PPE or anything to do with KEMSA. And it is so sad when even my relatives now think I'm a COVID billionaire and everybody who has a small problem is calling me to give them money. And you have put me into a lot of trouble. Thank you, Chair. Uh, let's call in the next witness. Yes, Mr. Chair. Mr. Chair. We have to have an internal. So we will definitely have an internal. Uh, media, media allows us to uh, just, you can leave your cameras, uh, switch them off, and then uh, so that for purposes of timing. Oh.
The nation was just a rich people. We are going to sue them.